What's going on guys, Max aka Immature here bringing you guys a finger tutting tutorial for beginners. Um, what I'm going to teach you guys today I like to call uh, finger puppets, some people call it finger faces or finger animals. And an example is the most common, the snake, or some people call the dragon or frog, and that looks like this. You can also go make him have a tongue, or if you just don't want anything, you can just have it like that. And you can mix this into tutting really easy. You could just be finger tutting something, doing whatever you like to do, and then just go right into it. And it's just so easy to mix into tutting. And so uh, let's get right into it. This is just one of them. I'll have a second tutorial on a second one that I actually created myself, and that's the bat. Um, but let's get started on this one. So what you want to do for this is it's facing towards you. Like, for example, when I do this, it looks like this from behind. Like, the thing, I have to move my hands around to show you. But it, it's fine, because if you're doing this in, like, a battle or something, you can just move your hands and like that. So how you do this is you start by having your hands touch like this to the side, have your pinkies touching completely, and your other hands just spread them apart as far as possible so you can understand this easier. And so if you're right-handed, it to me personally, it feels more comfortable if you take your uh, ring finger on your right hand and slide it behind your ring finger on your left hand, so like that. And so if you're left-handed, just do the opposite. It, but you can really test and see which you think is better, but I'm going to do it the right way, uh, just because I'm right-handed. So put your uh, ring finger behind your other one. Next, you're going to take your middle fingers and put them behind your ring fingers like this and touch them together just at the side, so like that. Then what you're going to do is you're going to take your pointer fingers and if you see the crease like right there in your uh, finger, just put your finger right there, your pointer fingers. So from the front, it'll look like that, the side, like that. Next, all you're going to do is this is the easiest part. Just pull down. And that's going to be like right here where you're pulling down and here. So just down and you'll get this. And it might be a bit off center like that. So just fix it. Next, all you do, put your thumbs together like that. And it just looks like that. And then uh, if you want to have him have this little thing on top, just lift your pinkies up. And you get that and you can move it really easily. Or if you want it to have the tongue... You go to the back and you slide your pinkies in, and it'll look like that. And then from the other side, it's like that, and it has its little mouth. So just to do this one more time, open your hands like this. Have your pinkies touching. Whatever hand you use, slide that ring finger behind the other. Then take your middle finger and slide that behind your ring fingers, put your pointer finger on the crease on your finger like that, pull down, straighten if you need to, connect your thumb, and there's the face. So tell me what you guys think of that, if you guys like it or not. Um, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. If you have any questions, leave it in the comments, and I'll see you in the next tutorial.